It's going to be boxing's biggest night, June 1st at Madison Square Garden, the mecca of all things boxing. And the challenger in the big title fight, Jarrell Big Baby Miller. What's his backstory? What's he thinking? Moments after a very combative press conference at Madison Square Garden with champion Anthony Joshua, we had an exclusive one-on-one -on -one interview with the challenger, taking an in-depth look at the business of boxing, the sport of boxing, where he's been, where he's going, and why he thinks he's gonna be a winner. Here's our exclusive look. Are there athletes that, that you look to for inspiration just in terms of how they've handled their career, their finances, their money, their endorsements, things like that? Who do you draw inspiration from? I mean, I mean, the first two names I'm going to give you won't be the most uh, respectable names, but they come from where I come from, and they've done great things. Not towards the end of the career, but I grew up on Mike Tyson and DMX. Mm -hmm. you know, I was, I was a, a, a young terror mentally. Yeah. But as I've gotten older now, as, as being a, a young man and a, and a man now, uh, I like LeBron James and what he's done off the mm -hmm. court. I've respected him more for what he's done on the court, and I'm a big fan of his and what he's done. Um, you know, you know, 50 Cent's another great guy that came from off the street, turns left around, and he's trying to put other people on in, in the business world or acting or music. So like I said before, I, I look at people that have done amazing things but come from similar backgrounds or even worse and, and, and beat the odds. But like I said, man, I'm just a different mentality kind of person. So well, what you might look up to, you'd be like, wow, you know, compared to what I look up to. So, you know, I'm, like I said, I'm from the trenches.